Do you want a push? Well, we're at Great Cumbry and this is the uh, town of Millport and um, it's the apparently there is a thousand bicycles here and there's certainly a roaring trade uh, for bicycle hire because it's just such an easy island to cycle round uh, you're not going up and down any hills particularly so um, you know if you're into cycling certainly something um, to do um, in that direction um, there's an anchorage um, where our salty lass over there is in a mooring now the mooring costs 10 pounds a night so you know not an awful lot really for a mooring uh, and it's incredibly good quality um, but it's such a pleasant place and um, Bev and I are enjoying our chill out here, our chillax. <laughs> Our friend Karen was coming aboard, so after a few days relaxing at Millport, we popped around the corner to Largs to collect her. Today we're motoring, but uh, stunning scenery regardless. At Largs, we met up with Karen and Steve and experienced something of a laundry malfunction. So what's happening now? Um, somebody left the towels out last night. And who put them out without pegging? I acted on the captain's instructions. <laughs> and what was the captain's instructions? To hang these over the guardrail. Yeah, but do you not think pegs would be in order? There's pegs for it. I'm not used to doing laundry. I'm an avatar dryer at home, that's my only Our fishing rod is um going fishing for towels. Going okay, fishing for towels. I've not really got our fishing rod out very often yet, but it's now going fishing for towels. <laughs> Bev's got one in already. So we're just gonna see if we can get the other towel. Downstairs we have Karen who is a manic cleaner. No I'm not! You told me to empty the bin and clean it, so I'm cleaning the bin. Yeah, you don't have to clean everything to the 990th degree, but... I do, I do. Like, I'm a 99% germ girl. Gone and yeah. go. So, that's the people, that's that's who we're going to have on board, a 99% I'm, germ girl. I'm going to check your corners, you know. I hope you're not living in a lighthouse. <laughs> I'm down here, haven't got my glasses on, but when I do put my glasses on, I'm going to get to the floor. <gasps> She's going to be scrubbing my floors, something that doesn't happen normally, but there you go. Well, we're at the um, Great Crumbry and the moorings um, just off uh, Millport. And um, what you have is what's called an honesty box. Um, a lot of places uh, in around this um, area operate honesty boxes. Um, the moorings are £10 a night here, and uh, you just put your money in the envelope and uh, through the door, and you're done. You know, so um, it's great. It's uh, good moorings, as I've said before. Well, Karen and I are at the Cathedral of the Isles, which is um, on Great Cumbrae, and uh, yes, it does have the smallest. Um, cathedral in the British Isles but as far as I'm concerned what it has is a really really good rope swing <laughs> she's gonna have a go and it's raining and swing on this rope um, crazy girl oh yeah oh 
Make sure you get your footing and hang on. Oh right, you've got you got your legs over that Getting stick. Off, just, um, hang on. Oh okay. Alright, it's nothing at the end that you can uh... <laughs> Oh good. It's gonna be tears. There's gonna be tears, I can tell. Are you are you able to jump on that and sit on it? Yeah, I should be. Oh, Ready. You should have had a couple of swings. Are you going again? Alright, do it again, Eddie. Hooray! Keep swinging. Keep swinging. Do you want to push? So where are we going Beverly? I'm having the foggiest idea, that way I think. Um, <laughs> we've just left Millport and... Um, What's she doing? I, I think the wind's turning. Right, I think this is going to be a bit short lived. Yeah, we're trying to go that way but I think the wind's decided we're going that way so... Um, it was a gust. Okay, we seem to come back under course. Um, we're trying to go to Rothsay in the Isle of Butte. So we'll just see how it works out. There's all sorts of things going on around me and I think they're slightly more deserving my attention than a piece of camera. Sorry fans, I know you love this sort of thing, but there's an emergency going on. There is not, but Bev's already watered. It's just the way she is. It wouldn't surprise me that we've got wind shifts near the islands. What are you doing, Karen? Oh. <laughs> I'm making lunch, but the best bits are up there. Yeah, I can show you mine. This bread was superb when we were in, what was it, co, 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 where, which last time? We were in Millport. Yeah, it reminds me of the old, um, like I'm 62, when as a child, my grandmother used to get those Vienna rolls and it just smells gorgeous. Poor again, I can't even have it because she's gluten free. sailing to Butte doing long wide tacks. If we were racing we'd be doing um, much shorter tacks um, but we're cruising so we're just sort of like enjoying nice long sails before we have to tack again. But it's quite pleasant isn't it Bev? We're sailing towards sunshine over toward Largs at Chuck and Dye. Yeah so we're sailing towards sunshine that's Always good to know, isn't it? Yeah. Um, yeah, we're just doing uh, little tacks off the lock so um, our crew can uh, get in her tacking practice between sleeps. Um, but it's really nice just to just sail. Okay, fair enough. We're going at an incredibly slow speed over ground, but what the heck? Just enjoy sailing. Well, we're in uh, Rothsay um, Harbour, which is on the Isle of Bute, um, and this is the inner harbour, which has got um, a three metre um, depth. Depth. Whereas the outer harbour is about a metre and a half, but there's also another area that's um, two to three metres depth. Um, so we should be fine, but. It's quite a small little harbour um, and you've got a couple of uh, right hand turns to get in. One left, one right. One left, one right. So, but I had plenty of depth underneath my keel. I had about five metres out there that you think, there's not going to have anything, but I actually had five. So, you know, depth wise it was uh, okay actually. Coming in was a bit tricky, um, but you know, 
if I can do it, you can too. And, <laughs> you know, and it's, I just look at it like that. You know, it is a bit, it is a bit cramped, but it'll be more interesting getting out, which I'm going to have to attack, but that's another day and not, not now. Meanwhile. Hello. <sighs> so. Is there a plan? Um, are you locking up? That's the plan. Okay, we're going to have a little nosy round and see what there is. It's looking rather pretty and there's a fishing boat there and yes, we're just going to go for it girls, aren't we? Yep. Explore. Uh, explore. Totally. <laughs> See the yachts are having to wait on it coming in. Well, so, uh, no, so where are we, Karen? Uh, God, I can never say it. E e Etak, Etik Bay, is it? Etrick. Etrick Bay, and it's beautiful and sunny, and we wear the costume. We've got the costume ready. But before I wear the costume, I'm going to attack this um, coffee um, cheesecake. I did want a tea and scone, but unfortunately this is all they had. And it is this is the Ettrick Bay Tea Room yeah. we're at. And this so, lovely coffee um, cheesecake, which I'm going to have some. Looks and, amazing, and look I'm, at that. And I'm hoping I'll be able to swim the calories off. There's no other bugger in the sea, just show them. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be looking at it at the moment, but it is Etrick um, Bay. But we are walking back, which is a two hour walk, I believe. <laughs> that will be good. So he's hoping that I'll go back thinner. <laughs> <laughs> in your dreams, girl, in your dreams. <laughs> And the sun's gone in, and we've both got costumes on that we haven't put on before. Unfortunately, <laughs> we've got issues. They touch where they fit, <laughs> literally. Um, and our boobs are just a bit big for them. We've tried our most, our best to try and suppress them. <laughs> I don't know. And um, that's going to be energy doubt, I suspect, but never mind. Uh, and, and it's look, cold. Well, anyway, this is. Well, is it cold? Good for you, Karen. I'll come and join you. I'll see how far I can go out before I... Okay. Well, sorry. We were slightly brave. We've got as far as our knees, didn't we, Karen? We certainly did. It just goes all the way out there. And we were tempted. It was nice and warm till... It came over our knees and then oh my god. Oh and no, also oh the no. sun and also the sun went in and it as soon as the sun went in it was just like no. <laughs> no. Um so at least I've done better than last year. I've got my swimming costume out and I've got my knees wet. <laughs> Not brilliant, but a bit better. Woo hoo! <laughs> <laughs> well, Karen and I are walking um Butte's Island West Way. So um, apparently it will take us about what two hours? Yeah, back to ba, 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 ba. Ro Ra Rothsay. So, but beautiful countryside, and at the moment I can smell cows. <laughs> <laughs> but but that's just us. life. <laughs> having a bathe the Karen at the top. And we are walking over to there, which is another port which is called um, Bannertine. And then hopefully from Bannertine we are then going to walk back to Rossi. Yes, that's the plan. Unless we can catch a bus. Yeah. Or jump on the back of a tractor. <laughs> oh, don't, don't do you know what? Before. I haven't done that for years. Oh, I've done it a few times. Yeah, <laughs> but it's, it's a long tractor. time ago though, Karen. <laughs> Karen, 
Karen and I have just walked from Ettrick Bay, uh, seeing a beautiful uh, church along the way, which was um, had no roof and everything, in it, but it was really, really pretty. Uh, and now we're at Bannatyne Bay, and um, Kems Bay, uh, there's an anchorage. Also, there's just behind me, um, there's moorings, well, not moorings, but there's a small marina, like you can see. But for Karen and I, there's also a playground. <laughs> Let's enjoy being the kids again, shall we? Yes, we're going for a swing. <laughs> That'll do. Right, Gaynor. <laughs> You've got to do a robin and jump, but if you can't get into it, there's no chance I can get into it. It's very high. Is it? Um, just push it well back and then get your derriere. My That's derriere it. in there? Yes. Turn round, go on, keep pushing back. Keep, no, 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 back, back, back. Keep going, pushing back, see if you can lift your deck. No, you've got no, no chance. It's not going to happen, Gary. There's a wheel, there's a way! Well, there is a. <laughs> oh, God. Get a decent height on it. Okay, Gaylor's going for it now. You can see the, the yachts. And you can see. Oh, Gaynor's derriere has just blocked the sun out. <laughs> I think we've done. We've earned our dinner. Do you reckon how we've earned a few calories? Yeah. There you but go. Also, every now and then you've got to remember that you're a kid in heart, at heart and not an adult. 